there, Digital Session 1 here, bringing you a Nerd Block unboxing for April 2014. Just a quick rundown for those of you who are unfamiliar with Nerd Block. It is a subscription service that brings you some awesome nerdy items right to your door, your mailbox, uh, similar to those that know of Loot Crate. Similar concept, chock full of stuff in here, but instead of Loot Crate's themes every month, they just jam pack it full of awesome goodies. And you're guaranteed a sweet shirt every single month. We're gonna open this thing up and see what's inside. First up, I just want to do one thing, hashtag nerdblock, you guys are awesome. Uh, so, first up, we have the shirt, Let's see if I can show you guys, bam, Spider Bite cereal shirt. It's got new electric blue marshmallows, and is fortified with vitamins essential for super heroics. And it's the officially sponsored cereal of your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, who is definitely not Peter Parker. Next up, we have the Avengers grab bags. Uh, let's see what's inside. It's a cool surprise. Um, so it could be anything from a Marvel mini to a disc launcher or a skateboard. And so basically just there's a whole bunch of things it could be. And we actually got a Loki skateboard. See Tom Hiddleston in all of his glory. Fun fact, by the way, um, I'm not actually sure if Loki specifically was here, but um, the movie Crimson Peak, which is coming out from Guillermo del Toro, was actually filmed in our town not too long ago, which is really cool. I didn't actually get to see it. Just um, pictures on the internet and read in stuff. There was a Guillermo del Toro sighting in town, which is super cool. Um, I had a couple friends that were extras in the movie, uh, in that scene, so hopefully get to see them on the big screen. But yeah, Tom Hiddleston, Loki, cool guy. So oh, next up we have the big ticket item that they were teasing at this month, a Transformers themed item, which is a Creo, um, figure pack. Basically, comes with Optimus Prime, Sentinel, uh, Megatron, Soundwave, and a mystery figure. I kind of don't want to open it up, but I I do because I I, I want to I want to see who the mystery guy is. So I already opened up the package, uh, assembled them and whatnot. So basically, if you're unfamiliar with Creo, it's basically like Lego and Mega Bloks. The little figurines are basically the same concept. So you no, know, just to give you a quick look at some of the guys, uh, I'm not a hundred percent sure. Who the mystery guy was? Um, I haven't watched Transformers since I was quite young, and I, I, to be honest, the Michael Bay movies went—they're okay. They're okay. Um, best guess I can venture at. This is the mystery one, by the way. Um, Starscream, maybe, just because of the wings, but I'm not 100% sure. If you do know, let me know in the comments below, just because I'm taking a shot at the dark at this. Next up, we have a Scalers brought to us by the good people at NECA. Um, they make a bunch of awesome products. Anyways, so basically these little figurines, they just hang on cords like headphones or chargers or whatever like that. that stop them from getting tangled or whatever. I got Gizmo from the Gremlins. Great old classic movie. And I'm sure as long as I don't get it wet or, you know, feed this thing after midnight, I should be fine. It won't disrupt my music or anything, hopefully. Next, we have rabbits, those Rayman raving rabbits. Um, basically, I haven't actually seen Travel in Time in about three years. This is a pretty old game, and I'm kind of surprised they're still making these figures. But anyways, I got a ninja. Um, gotta be honest, probably the best one I could have asked for, just because I like ninjas. Ninjas over pirates, don't hate me or anything. Last up, we have probably my favorite item in this nerd block. We have... Chris Kirkman from the Bravest Warriors. Um, so first out, first off, sorry, I just want to give a quick shout out to my friend Sophia for introducing me to the show. I'm totally obsessed with it now, um, and it goes super well with my gas-powered stick bag that I got from uh, I think last month's Loot Crate, their Warriors Loot Crate. So love Bravest Warriors. Really glad I got uh, Chris. As between Chris and Wallow, those are probably my two favorites out of the full cast. Although Catbug, Catbug, you're great. Um, anyways, if you haven't seen Bravest Warriors, go watch it. They are already on their second season. Their next episode's not for another month or so, but there's 
if you haven't watched it, just plow through the first two seasons, all the minisodes, all that type of stuff. If you're a fan of Adventure Time or being, uh, being Puppy Cat, you're going to love the show. Great fun. Love it. Love it. Anywho, bam, box is empty. That's all for April. If you enjoyed what you saw, go check out Nerd Block. I'll have a link over here and down below. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to subscribe. Check out the Facebook page. Give it a big thumbs up, a big like, and follow me over on Twitter if you want at Digital Szechuan. Thanks for watching. Have an awesome day. Peace.